So with the emergence of artificial intelligence and robots essentially killing all video editing jobs, but I bet you did already know that Adobe Premiere already has integrated Adobe Sensei or AI-like tools that you might have never been aware about. Well, I'm gonna walk you through each one that might help you speed up your editing process. So the first one is auto detect scene. This is great if you already have an existing clip that's already rendered in one file and you wanna splice that up. And you're like, you have to go frame by frame and manually edit, or all you do is go into your clip, go into the top toolbar here, and then you should see scene edit detection. You click that, apply a cut at each detected cut point, and you also create a marker. I'm gonna uncheck that, click analyze, and as you can see here, it's essentially autopod. And Premiere just automatically created cuts on each one of these clips without me having to touch or watch this footage at all. So you have a raw video clip that has a bunch of cuts and it's one single 20 minute video and you wanna splice it up, auto scene detect will be a game changer. The next one is text to speech. So if you are still in this day and age, still manually captioning all of your video files, you don't know, need to go to a website like rev.com. Go to your, uh, right here, your graphics tab and you go to text and you can create captions from a transcript, you can transcribe your sequence. You hit transcribe and Premiere will automatically start transcribing all of your audio sequences. From there, what you can do is you can create captions from this. And if you wanna see a more detailed video, I have that in my previous video, check the video out, how you turn your captions and make it into animations for your subtitles. And now in Premiere, if you have the newest version, you can actually go right here, text-based editing. What that means is once you transcribe your text, you can simply, instead of going to a clip and edit, you can just search up whatever transcription that it has, and you can manually just click backspace, and it will select the points, and it will cut out the points all through things like text. And this is essentially the script. I don't have it right now because I'm also simultaneously recording my screen capture and it's gonna crash my laptop, <laughs> in case you're wondering. The next AI or robot editing tool is the Remix tool. So for the longest time, if you have been, let's say you have, you wanna put a, this video that I have on my other channel, Broke the Habit, is just a talking head and I want to have an overlaying background track but that track itself is only two minutes, but the entire YouTube video is 20 minutes. Really simple. All you need to do now is you go to this tool right here, ripple delete, you click it and you let it hold for, you long press it for two seconds, remix, grab your same music clip and drag it as long as you want. Premiere Pro will automatically recreate this track and stretch it out with any, without any weird transitions. It sounds like one seamless audio clip. Just let it analyze and voila, it just saved you so much time instead of manually cutting, doing a cross dissolve, making sure this goes up and blending it in and I'll crossfade and all that headache. You're welcome. Auto color grading. If you're in a very rush and you don't have time to put it into like DaVinci Resolve, right? For the longest time, Adobe has already done color grading automatically. Let's turn off this adjustment layer. I click my clip that I wanna color grade and there's this auto button over here with the magic wand. I click auto, give it some time to render and process. And as you can see, Premiere just automatically color corrected my footage. Although it is not as great in comparison to what I had before, if you're in a quick vlogger, you wanna put up a quick YouTube video and you don't wanna go through the process of color grading, there's that one button, automatically colors it. Of course, it's not gonna be colorist grade, but it's better than nothing, and especially if you're in a hurry. But as you already know, this is my own color grading on top of that, right? You're not gonna get this look by auto 
clicking that. But if you're just a vlogger, that button can save you a lot of time. And that, guys, was five AI tools that will speed up your workflow in Premiere Pro that you probably didn't know about. And this is the 2023 version, version 23. And with AI coming onto Premiere, like Firefly, editing is gonna be a lot more easier. What you need to focus on now is how to utilize these tools and incorporate them into your already existing video linear workflow. If you want to get serious about Premiere Pro or learning video editing or getting your first client, I have courses on all that in the description below. And if you want to get into the future of video creation and short form content, I also have a course on that. And if you want to get help from me one on one, link is description below. Help me help you. You're watching Broke Vision Collective, where we all start with nothing, but you can always create something. Cheers, guys.